हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक एंड ग्रीटिंग्स फ्रॉम द ऑर्ब स्कूल वेलकम बैक टू मैथ्स क्लास इन आर लास्ट लाइव सेशन वी हैव लर्न टू से नंबर्स 51 टू 60 एंड हाउ टू काउंट देम यस वी लर्न टू काउंट ऑब्जेक्ट्स 51 टू 60 नाउ टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न नंबर 61 टू 70 फर्स्ट वी विल लर्न टू से देम इन सीक्वेंस एंड देन वी विल लर्न टू काउंट देम Yes, so now it's time to say numbers 61 to 70 in sequence. Children, you are going to look at the number and you are going to say it with me. 61, then 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69 and then 7070. Now imagine that you have a balloon in your hand and then we will practice one more time. 61, you have to imagine that you have a balloon in your hand and then you have to start saying numbers, okay? 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69 and 70. It's time to count objects. Today we are going to count objects. Yes, and we are going to count objects from 61 to 70. It means 6 bundle of 10s and 1 makes 61 to 7 bundle of 10s. Okay, so let's do it. We will count number of bananas. Let's count in one bundle. How many bananas are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. In one bundle, there are 10 bananas. Now let's count how many bananas are here. In one bundle, as we counted, there are 10 bananas. So we have to skip count by 10s and we have to count these bananas. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 and 1, 61. There are 61 bananas here. Now, let's count how many bananas are here. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 61 and 62. There are 62 bananas here. Now, let's count these bananas. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 and 61, 62 and 63. There are 63 bananas here. Now let's count how many bananas are here. As we know we have 6 bundles of 10 and it means there are 60 bananas. And here 61, 62, 63 and 64. There are 64 bananas here. Now let's count how many bananas are here. As we all know 6 bundles mean 60 bananas and 61, 62, 63, 64 and 65. There are 65 bananas are here. Let's count these bananas. 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65 and 66. There are 66 bananas here. Let's count these bananas. 60, then 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66 and 60. Seven. There are 67 bananas here. Now, these are 67 bananas. And if I add one here, it will become 68. There are 68 bananas. Now, 
I will add one more here and it will become 69 bananas. And if I add one more, it will become 7 bundles. There are 7 bundles of 10 bananas each. It means there are 70 bananas. 7, 0, 70 bananas. We have learnt counting objects from 61 to 70. Now it's time to practice counting number of objects from 61 to 70. For that we require our little thinker math book. On page number 3636 and on page number 3737 we will practice counting our number of objects. For that first thing we are going to write the date in the left side corner on both the pages. Once this is done, we will start counting. Here it is given the marbles. Yes, and they are in a bag. Can you see a small bag? Yes. Now let's see how many marbles are in one bag. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. In one bag there are 10 marbles. Here also it is written one bag there are 10 marbles and we have already learnt to count by tens so we will do that 10 20 30 40 50 60 and here it is 1 so 60 1 we have to search where is number 61 here no here it is so first thing we will do we will trace the number we will say and write 6 1 61 and we will match it with the correct box same way here again you will count 10 20 30 40 50 60 61 and 62 we have to search where is number 62 here it is so how you will write you will say the number and you will trace it 6 2 62 and then we are going to match it with the correct box the same way you will count this also this also this also and then on the next page you will count this also 10 20 30 40 50 60 will you say 70 here no because these marbles are loose marbles so you have to say 61, 62, 63, 64, 65 and 66. What we have to do now? We have to search where is number 66. Oh, here it is. So now you have to say the number, you have to trace it and you have to write it. 6, 6, 66. After tracing the number, you are going to match it with the correct box the same way you will count this box this box this box and here i cannot see any loose marbles so what will happen oh don't worry we know how to use keep counting method so let's do it 10 20 30 40 50 60 and 70 that is 7 0 70 now we have to search where is number 70. Oh, here it is. So we will trace it and we will say it and we will write 7070 and then we will match it with the correct box. This way you are going to complete both these pages. Now it's time to learn how to write number 61 to 70 in sequence. For that we need our pencil time math book. Yes, you need to open the next page and in the left side corner you will write today's date that is 9.9.20 .9 and then you will write the heading here. Numbers 61-70 it means 61 to 70. In the second line you will put dots it means we are going to leave that line. And in the third line, again like this, you will put two dots, then you will write T-O, then four dots, again T-O. It means you are going to write numbers 61 to 70 two times. 
and then you are going to write the numbers this way one time here as i have shown and one more time here but children make sure that when you write the number you always say the number and then write it correctly don't write all six first and then one two three it's a wrong method so please don't write that way i hope children you must have understood how to write numbers 61 to 70 how to say them in sequence and how to count number of objects thank you